Well, in this morning's U.S. Bank Economic 360, concerns from Washington around the mounting U.S. debt totals. A high degree of debt at the federal level limits our flexibility in a number of ways, but as concerning as the current $16.8 trillion debt may be, there is actually some good news to report. U.S. Bank senior equity strategist Jim Russell joins Business Courier editor Rob Dawmeyer in the studio with some insight. Gentlemen. Thanks, Peg. Jim, thanks for being here. Good morning. So stop it with this good news out of Washington thing. That, that can't be possible. Uh, under the category of things that you thought you would never see, we are getting some uh, good news out of Washington on the budgetary matters. Rob, it was reported uh, just recently from the Congressional Budget Office that after years of $1 trillion per year, or more annual budget deficits that it appears that the budget deficit for 2013 will be 648 billion dollars now that's still a considerable amount of money right and uh, we and more work needs to be done but certainly uh, headed in the right direction really to put a little bit more icing on that cake is that over the next two years 2014 and 2015 it does appear that that deficit will also continue to drift down looks like 2015 might come in in the 375 billion dollar deficit kind of range Again, a big number, but again, headed in the right direction. Is it good enough? Uh, we think not. Uh, we think that, frankly, uh, the annual um, uh, deficit continues to, you know, pile on debt when it's not needed. And this ahead of uh, Social Security, Medicare, Medicaid, frankly, entitlement explosions. So we have a graph here that will show actually the progress on the U.S. Uh, debt. You can see that yep. uh, since the financial crisis it is really kind of hooked a little bit more north. That's not the trend that we want to see. But again, the most recent figures that I uh, mentioned just a minute ago would indicate that the, uh, the, uh, the amount of debt being added is, is rolling down just a little bit. But again, this is right before uh, uh, an explosion in entitlement. So we think that um, more tax increases will be, need to be had, and we think that actual uh, spending cuts will also need to be had. What do you see coming uh, in the future on this next six months or maybe a year? What kind of announcements or what kind of plans do you think they're going to put out there? There's a very important signpost in October, November time frame, just literally this year, where we'll have to raise the debt ceiling yet again. We're looking for Washington to perhaps uh, raise that debt ceiling and in exchange for that address long-term entitlement reform which means long-term deficit re uh, reform which means that interest rates will stay low and economic growth will stay steady so we're looking forward to that we're putting our faith in Washington maybe a little bit misplaced stay tuned well I'm sure we'll be talking about that one again yes sir Jim thanks